Hello everyone and welcome! I'm Kiv Kiv, your favorite degenerate, and today we're going to be going through what we know about Fireteam Taurus, the new Spartan team that will be involved in Halo Infinite Story. We don't know exactly to what level of involvement they have, but I wanted to go over everything that we know so far about the fire team, its members, and what we might be able to tell from the info we've got. This all became possible because the voice actor Verlin Roberts actually let slip on a podcast. I'll leave a link in the description for those of you who may want to watch the entire thing and get his exact words, but basically he let slip that he was the voice actor for Spartan Griffin, who was going to be involved in the story of Halo Infinite alongside Spartan Stone and the rest of the members of Fireteam Taurus. Not only did he do voice acting, but he also did mocap work, so that means he's probably going to be involved in a few cinematics as well. The thing I'm most interested about is if they're going to be involved in the main story, or if this is going to be part of a side story that is going to feature their entire fire team. The other members of this fire team are called Oshiro and Dimka. I apologize, my Australian accent is kind of butchering that, but one sounds Japanese and one sounds Russian. So I'm not sure if they have done vo uh, voice acting work as well. We know that back in 2558, the fire team had a range of different Gen 2 armors, including the Enforcer, Soldier, Recruit, and Warrior class armors. Uh, but then also during Operation Wolf, which is in the book Shadows of Reach, they used Gen 3 armor with Spartan Stone using the Trailblazer, which I think looks pretty cool, and Griffin using the Mark 7 armor. We have no idea what kind of Gen 3 armor Oshiro and Dimka wear, but uh, from the sounds of it, it looks like different characters are going to have different levels of involvement in the game. Because Verlin was called back for extra mocap and voice acting work, whereas the Spartan Stone actor wasn't. So I think it's probably very likely that he's going to be the leader of the fire team, uh, and this is going to allow him to be more involved in the story and will have more interactions with the chief. Obviously, guys, take everything that I say with a grain of salt because all we have to go off of is Mega Constructs images. And those aren't bad, but it's not exactly like it's directly from 343. And on top of that, the armor for Spartan Griffin in this is purple. And I've never seen a purple Spartan in a Halo campaign before, so I'm not sure how I feel uh, about that being actually in the game. Uh, I mean, the armor I can definitely see happening but I don't think they'd have him as a purple Spartan, maybe just as a bunch of black Spartans uh, with different colouring as the trim. But this does open up the question to if the Chief is going to be meeting a whole bunch of different Spartans while he's on the ring, or if this is kind of a rare one-off sort of thing. Uh, it, there's a lot of possibilities. But we do know that the story they want to tell is between the Chief and the Pilot, so I don't see them as being major characters, more just related to one or two individual missions. That's my prediction. I think it would be awesome to see more Spartans involved in the story, uh, and it also reminds me exactly of how Reach used to be with the cutscenes. Having a team of Spartans for the Chief to work with is an insanely good idea, and they would be stupid not to do it, because it would be such a nice change of pace going from babysitting Marines to actually having Spartans that are on par with the Chief. Like, if you actually end up coordinating with them to take down, like, a banished stronghold or something, that would be awesome as far as I'm concerned. In saying that, Griffin may not be the leader because while you end up working with all of Noble Team, you actually, on mission, end up spending a fair bit of time with Cat during Tip of the Spear and also Oni Sword Base. But, uh, yeah, that covers just about everything for today, guys. I hope you all enjoyed the video and you know what to do if you want to see more content like this. I'll see you all on the next one. I've been Kiv, and I'm out.